All right, everybody, welcome to what is going to be the first of the Urban Gardener's top 10 videos. We're going to be putting out different uh, top 10 lists here throughout the growing season. And today's video is going to be on seed catalogs. It's those cold winter months that we've been going through and we've all been kind of hunkering down and going through all the different various seed catalogs that have been arriving in the mail lately and kind of just uh, dreaming and thinking about all the wonderful things that we're going to be able to grow in our gardens coming up in the spring and summertime. Um, seed catalogs are a really good distraction from all of those things going on in the winter time so um really great to be able to dig into them as you can see i've got a ton of them i've been uh going through and not necessarily collecting seed catalogs but checking out different seed companies throughout the years i've been gardening and um, i have found a few that i really really enjoy some that i've done some business with and really like the customer service with some of these seed catalogs, I just really like the way the catalogs are put together. But what we're going to do here is we're just going to go over the top 10 Urban Gardener seed catalogs. Now, mind you, none of these seed companies are sponsoring this video or paying me at all. These are just all uh, different uh, experiences of my own that I'm going to share with you. So, all right, real quick, before we get into our top 10 list, I want to just go over a couple of honorable mentions here before we get going. Um they don't have seed catalogs. That's why we're not putting them into the list. Uh, They're just available online. The first one is uh, True Leaf Market. Now, True Leaf Market, I purchased some microgreens from a couple of seasons ago. I really like the way they've got their website set up. They just changed over from having a catalog that they published for years to doing online only. And that's something that we're gonna to have to think about too in the future of seed catalogs is that uh, more and more companies becoming eco-friendly moving over to uh, just a mainly uh, online catalog. So um, True Leaf Market, uh, really great. You check them out also too. I just wanna mention um, all of these uh, different companies that we're talking about are available in links down in the description. So you can check them all out through those links down below. So go check that out as well too. Next up in our honorable mention is Little Shop of Seeds. Little Shop of Seeds was a small online seed store that was started by the YouTube gardener Ray Browning over on the channel Praxis55712. When I first started doing my gardens years ago, I got onto YouTube to check out how to grow tomatoes and found Ray Browning's channel and has been following him ever since. And a couple of years ago, he started a online seed store, The Little Shop of Seeds, where he's offering seeds at only 55 cents. Just 55 cents for a good amount of seed, too. And just not all of that fancy packaging or all of that. So don't expect any of that from Ray's uh, Little Shop of Seeds, but expect uh, to get some nice, inexpensive seeds for your garden. He's got a a wide variety of those typical varieties of uh, things that you're growing in your gardens. So I recommend that you stop by uh, Ray's Little Shop of Seeds uh, before you get started on all of your other seed catalogs and see if he's got some really good uh, uh, varieties that you might want to start in your garden. So now let's get started with our top 10. Coming in at number 10 is Select Seeds. Select Seeds is a seed company out of Connecticut and they primarily do uh, flowers, at least, you know, as far as what they're mailing in their catalog. Again, though, they do at selectseeds.com have a good wide variety of vegetable seeds that you can grow in your garden as well. But uh, I picked them at number 10 because uh, they got a good variety of flowers. I've uh, been trying to incorporate more color, more flowers, you know, try to uh, attract more of the pollinators into my garden. So that was one of the things I kind of wanted to uh, do a little bit more of this season. So I've kind of checked into Select Seeds and I've ordered a couple of varieties of their flowers that will be growing in the gardens this year. Coming in at number nine, we've got so true seed 
So True Seed is a small seed company out of North Carolina, and they've got a good wide variety of seeds. There's a lot packed into this small uh, seed catalog. They've got a lot of different varieties, but the one reason why I picked this one was because it is a nice small seed catalog with a lot to choose from as well, and it's very well put together too. They've got a lot of uh, good information on all the different varieties, as well as really good, uh, good quality color pictures as well. For a small seed catalog, that's really good. So check out So True Seed as well. Number eight is Johnny Select Seeds. Now everybody knows about Johnny's. Johnny's um, is really one of those great seed catalogs. This is one that you can get a good look at so many different varieties. I mean, they're just packed and packed full of stuff. And one of the things that I really have been checking out with different seed companies lately is their selections of microgreens. I've been liking to grow a lot of different microgreens, especially during these winter months as well, when there isn't much to be growing out in the garden. You know, um, you've got some good greens and things that are kind of coming out of the garden during the winter months and it's good to just kind of add some good microgreens that you can grow as well right inside your house and johnny select seed has a lot of great quality ones so i really recommend johnny select seeds they've got a really great catalog again get down in the description below and check for a link to all of these different seed companies and um go and check them out there online number seven Seed Savers Exchange. Now, Seed Savers Exchange is a really popular uh, seed catalog with a lot of the different gardeners that I know and talk to as well. They've recommended Seed Savers Exchange to me several seasons ago, and I've bought in several different varieties from them and grown them in the garden too. I find that they have a really good quality seeds, and their catalogs are packed with a lot of really good information, some cool little uh, articles and features as well, and um, really good bright pictures too. You gotta love the bright pictures of all those different uh, vegetables and uh, different things that you wanna grow in your garden. So I really recommend Seed Savers Exchange. In at number six is Pine Tree Garden Seeds. Pine Tree, really great seed catalog. Now, one of the things that I critique a seed catalog on when I'm looking through a lot of these different catalogs is the information that they're giving you in the catalog about um, how to plant, the different types of uh, tips and things like that that you could use for growing a lot of the different varieties that they offer in their catalog. And Pine Tree does a really great job at that. They've got a lot of good uh, tips and recommendations that go right along with the different um, really great um, colorful pictures and uh, great information as well on each of their different varieties so again I recommend here at number six pine tree garden seeds so all right coming in at number five is a seed company that I have a bit of experience with on this list because I've gotten to actually go visit the store uh, they're just a couple of hours north of me from where I live here in southern Oregon up in Cottage Grove Oregon is a territorial seed company the territorial seed company is a really popular seed catalog amongst gardeners out there um, I've gotten to uh, grow several different varieties of things offered in their catalog. Um, in fact, we grow uh, a couple of different uh, tomato varieties. I have this really great, delicious uh, pineapple tomato that I grow that came from Territorial Seed as well. They put together a really great catalog, again, packed with a lot of different information and uh, Lots of different things that you need to know about growing the different varieties of seeds that they offer in their catalog. And again, a lot of just really great, bright, uh, really detailed pictures to go along with it as well. So recommend getting down in the description and checking out the uh, link for Territorial Seed Company. Now, all right, coming in at number four is a seed catalog that I really enjoy getting in the mail every year kind of takes me back a little bit even though they're making it now it's just that it's a really fun catalog it's fedco seed catalog um, fedco puts together a really kind of cool 
almost like old timey type of catalog with really cool uh, illustrations throughout the whole catalog. Lots of great information on all the different varieties of things that they offer as well. But uh, just a really, really cool catalog put together. I really enjoy this one. I recommend you get this one here just, just for the fact that it's fun to look through. And that's really something cool about some of the seed catalogs is what do they have to offer that's really a sense of enjoyment. Because what we're really doing is we're looking forward to our upcoming growing season. And that brings a lot of joy to us too. So we might as well have some really good uh, detailed catalogs like Fedco offers as well too. So uh, check out Fedco Seed Company there as well. So now we're getting down to it. Top three seed catalogs here on the Urban Gardener. Uh, coming in at number three, Kitsawa Seed Company. Kitsawa. Just a basic, simple seed catalog offered by a seed company out of the Bay Area. Uh, lots of different really great uh, Asian vegetable seeds that they have offered in here. Um, some really cool varieties that you might not uh, have thought about growing in your garden. Uh, so I really recommend getting in and checking out Kitsawa Seed Company's uh, seed catalog. Like I said, it's just a simple seed catalog. A couple of different illustrations put in there. And um, just a really great company. I think I really like this seed catalog based a lot on just the fact that they have a lot of different unique varieties of seeds that they offer there too. Uh, lots of great Asian vegetables. So check out uh, Kitsawa Seed Company down in the link below in the description there as well as all the other different seed catalogs that uh, we're showing here today on the Urban Gardeners Top 10. Um, number two. Number two is a really great seed catalog. I do a lot of different business with. I buy a lot of the different microgreens that I grow from them. I really like uh, a lot of the different uh, varieties that they offer. I really like the way that they put their catalog together. It's high mowing seeds. High mowing organic seeds is uh, just a really great seed catalog. They've got a lot of really great varieties of all sorts of different vegetables to grow in your garden this year. Um, I really recommend uh, high mowing. Again, like I said, I buy a lot of different microgreens from them as well as I've grown leeks, cucumbers, and uh, different tomatoes as well that I've gotten from high mowing too. Really packed with a lot of great information, lots of uh, really cool um, diagrams and uh, different um, different features and things like that that they show you for uh, growing a lot of the different varieties that they have in this sat that they have in this catalog. <laughs> so all right, in at number one on our top 10 list here on the Urban Gardener for seed catalogs is everybody's favorite seed company. I've asked a lot of people all over, lots of different gardeners, and we've had a lot of different conversations about uh, seed companies out there, and everybody raves about Baker Creek Heirloom Seed Company. Baker Creek has been putting out probably one of the most quality and really, really cool uh, seed catalogs for years now. And um, not only that, this is their free seed catalog that they offer. It's full of just great, great features and just awesome, colorful, uh, deep, cool, up close pictures. Just rich in colors of all of the different varieties that they offer in this magazine. It's really, really put together. I said magazine <laughs> because it is. It's almost put together like kind of a really cool garden uh, seed catalog magazine. They put a uh, bunch of different really cool little stories and stuff that they include there as well. But not only do they have this free seed catalog that you can get if you uh, get that link down below in the description for Baker Creek Heirloom Seed Company, um, if you uh, go onto their website or also been available in different bookstores or different uh, grocery uh, store um, magazine racks over the last couple of years as well is uh, available for purchase um, is the uh, basically the like the old if you remember uh, Sears catalog 
the big, huge uh, Baker Creek Heirloom Seed Company whole seed catalog. I mean, this is a monster. It's huge. It's thick. It's been getting bigger every single year. They've been packing more and more into this uh, catalog um, every single year. It's a real delight to get in uh, in the mail. Um, I uh, make sure that I order one, uh, as you can see, every single year for the last at least five or six years now. Um, just uh, really, really enjoy all of the different heirloom variety seeds that they put in together on, on this. And again, packed with a ton of cool stories and information about all of these really cool seed varieties that they uh, find to put in here. It's kind of like... Um, a real um, like curating an art gallery in some sense, you know, that they've really curated some of these really great uh, heirloom seeds and these really great seed stories as well over the years too. Um, again, number one too, you know, um, not just that, you know, I get a lot of, uh, that I hear from a lot of different other gardeners out there. Just a really great company too, really great people. If you've been watching our channel here on The Urban Gardener, we haven't been, we didn't get a chance to this last year, but uh, uh, each of our first uh, few years here on the channel, we uh, kind of uh, ended our seasons by going down to uh, California to the uh, Baker Creek Heirloom Seed Company's um, uh, heirloom uh, festival that they put on down there the national heirloom exposition and uh, it's just a really great time and it's a really great opportunity to uh, meet up with uh, the owners uh, Jerry, Ger Jerry Gettle who puts uh, together this uh, catalog along with all of the different people who work for him in Baker Creek who are there at that uh, exposition. Just a really great time, something to look forward to here in the upcoming year or so as we uh, start to get things back to normal. But really recommend checking out uh, Baker Creek Heirloom Seed Company's whole seed catalog. I think these are running around uh, twelve dollars or so maybe just a little bit more but again you can get down in the description and check the link out there and you can uh, find that as well real quick today's top 10 list was put together by myself for the urban gardener based on the different experiences i've had with these different seed companies and seed catalogs but i wanted to find out what some of you out there in the gardening community think of as your favorite seed companies and seed catalogs so I asked on a post on Facebook earlier on a couple of different garden groups, what do you think of as your favorite garden catalogs? So um, put together a different list of the different responses we got. We got a total of 83 different responses, about 70 different uh, votes, and uh, these companies right here uh, came in with one vote each. And there are just a lot of different seed companies out there. And uh, not only do I recommend the ones that we put together for our top 10 list here, all the different ones being mentioned here as well by other different uh, gardeners out there in our community, plus all the different uh, companies that are out there. Like I said, there's just so many of them, so many different uh, seed companies and uh, some of them uh, might not have been mentioned that are your favorite. So get down in the comment section below and let us know some of your favorite seed companies out there. In fact, if you got a bunch of them that you like and can put together your own top 10 list, get down there and put together a top 10 list of your own, okay? These companies right here, there was five of them that came in with two votes each. So we've got these five seed companies, got two votes each on our post earlier, and uh, these, Three companies here came in with uh, five votes each. Vessi's, Territorial, one of my favorites here that was on our top 10 list, and Pine Tree as well, which was on our list. So those three got five votes each, and we got, uh, looks like I skipped over one here. I got three votes. Uh, botanical interests. Botanical interests made the list with uh, three votes for it and the top three seed companies on this post that I posted earlier on uh, different garden groups comes in at uh, seven votes. Johnny Seed Company. Johnny Seed Company like we talked about earlier in our top 10 list a uh, great great seed catalog full of great information, lots and lots of different varieties to choose from, 
and uh, really recommend really popular Johnny Seed Company at seven votes. And then at number two on this list here that was uh, voted on by different gardeners on a post that we put out on a garden group earlier, uh, number two is a seed company that I didn't mention in our top 10 list um, is a Burpee Seed Company. Burpee Seed Company, um, the reason why I didn't make our list earlier uh, for our top 10 was because the only uh, interaction I've had with Burpees as a company is buying their seed packets um, at big box stores. You know, they have their big displays there at those big box stores and Burpee is one of those companies that you'll see all over the place. And I've bought several different varieties of seeds from them too and have grown them in the garden. Just, you know, I hadn't really interacted or uh, bought out of their seed catalog at all before just at their displays at big box stores so uh, that's why they didn't make my list but they are really really popular amongst all of you gardeners out there uh, so burpees uh, seed company down in the description or down in the description below we'll have a link for that and of course number one in our top 10 list Number one on your list out there in our garden groups, all of you gardeners out there just completely agree that uh, Baker Creek Heirloom Seed Company just uh, owns the day when it comes to seed catalogs out there. Just a really great seed company. Really, really enjoy Baker Creek Heirloom Seed Company. So that's the list there. Oh, and Baker Creek got 13 votes too. So um, really uh, great. Uh, a list of different seed catalogs and as I mentioned there's just a bunch out there let us know down in the comments below some of your favorite seed catalogs maybe put together one of your own top 10 lists for uh, seed catalogs so there we have it tons of seed catalogs to go through we've got a lot to choose from we've got a lot of dreams ahead of us for our spring and uh, summer gardens so uh, I'm gonna get down to it I'm gonna get ordering some more seeds to finish out what I've got to put together for my gardens I hope that you check out some of these seed companies too and uh, get a chance and opportunity to uh, check out some of the seeds that they have available for your garden as well Thanks for joining me here today on the first of the Urban Gardener's Top 10 Seed Catalogs. Be the first edition. Edition. Is it an edition? I don't know if it's an edition. <laughs> it might be an edition. It might be an episode. It might be a... I don't know. What is it, actually? That's a good question.